Hello and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. And uh, after a little bit of searching, I think I've actually found the tree I was looking for in the last episode in which I built this plane for. So we're going to go down and take a look, see if this is the one we need. If this is the thing we're looking for. So, yeah. Try not to lose sight of it because I don't want it to despawn if if it is what we're looking for. So, yeah, I did actually get a pilot on board this time and that dramatically improved stability. So, oh, I don't want to crash into the thing. I think that is it. I think that is definitely what we're looking for. So... I'm going to turn around here and we'll scan this thing. This is exciting because I haven't found one of these first. What's this? You can't be. I've returned to the surface. Okay. Didn't know that. Yeah, so I think this is definitely the tree I'm looking for. I'm going to presume. I want to go backwards or forwards a little bit. Let's try and get positioned here. This is not going well. <laughs> OK, that should be good, I think. So if we open this, and we will play our animation here, hopefully, scan distance 4 meters, and we're not in range. This is the tree, right? This is definitely the tree. This has got to be the tree. Yes. Scan. 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 Why isn't it scanning? Ah, this tree is too far below that base player cannot reach. Okay. Let's do that. There we go. The angle was too steep, wasn't it? Vessel moved aboard. Right, turn them engines off because I think they're interfering. Let's see this thing in action. This is exciting. Look at this. This is pretty cool. I have to admit, this is really cool. Now goes drilling it. Microscope. Only eight in science. So we have to transmit this, so let's get this up. That's using a lot of electric. Here we go. There we go, and that contract is done. That's brilliant. Nice. So what we're going to do here actually is we're going to get out. Um, I will just we'll take the pilot out. Oh, 
grab onto the ladder, please. There we go. Um, this ladder is in the worst place. There we go. I like this little um, character screen it has now. So yeah, we're going to take a set for sample as well. Keep that. And we are going to plant the flag right next to this tree. So here we go. And we're going to call it tree. The first place we found a tree there we go flags being planted look at this this is actually an awesome screenshot that's probably the thumbnail I'm, I'm going to admit that's that probably is the thumbnail so that's the first actual interactive thing we found and I'm starting to like it now I'm really starting to like it. I need to... Will this work properly? Pro yes, it will work properly. Now that that's... Done. So, what we'll do... Is this going to go back in at any time? Paused. Clean. That it should do its job. Yeah, it is doing its job. Then we'll fly back to the Kerbal Space Center and then retire this craft. It's done its job pretty well. I don't think there's anything left on Kerbin to find. Activate engines. Turn, try not hit the tree. And full throttle. Let's get out of here. Now we've found that. That is, it's pretty handy to use a plane to find these things. I'm going to be honest. Oh, there we go. Bump up. So you can see how far away we were. It's just there. And there's the Kerbal Space Center. So we'll see when we get back f how far it actually is away. It is pretty far. Still haven't found one on Mimus yet. Haven't had a good ta chance to... Um, search for it but we will find it eventually definitely will find it eventually <laughs> should we use the afterburners to get back quicker I've n I don't think I've ever used the afterburners on these engines I want to point up a little bit that's go like this right ready toggle toggle Yes. That is some speed. This is a nice little craft. Got to see I really like this craft. I'm going to turn them off now because we're going to end up losing our solar panels at this rate. Okay, so I want to turn out I'm going to come in over the sea, I think, is the best way to do it. Yeah, I think that's the best way. So there, about 25 kilometers, I think that's where it spawns. So that's probably how far I'm going to have to drive at Minmus to try and find these things. Let's get our gears down. Hopefully we'll land this thing without crashing. Ooh, I do want to save all this, all the parts from this. Because I want to be a renewable um, space agency. I want to be able to save on the most parts we can. 
even though the trip to Minmus we did waste quite a bit, but we'll just not talk about that. Let's just forget that ever happened. Oh, got too much speed, haven't we? I'll just turn the engines off, just cut them completely. So we'll come down on the runway. Oh, bit of a bounce, bit of a bounce. Oh. That will do me perfectly fine. That is bouncy wheel. There we go. And we will recover that. And there we go, that is brilliant. Didn't spend any money on that mission. So the next mission is, what do we have? Building the space station around Kerbin. I don't know if I want to do that one. I don't know if I want to do that one because it's not really using the new parts. But the new surface outpost on Minmus. I've already done that. Completion, 600,000. How's it on par? Can generate power. How is it? These six curls. Mine does. Doesn't have a viewing thing. Hmm. Don't know if that will just work if I activate that. Should I just try it? See what happens. Let's just see what we've complete. We haven't completed anything. This must be a new outpost built. Moving parts. Alright, so we did just waste our time getting that. So we'll have to do another one. But anyway, this has been a short one today. But I was excited to find that thing. And so if you did like it, like and subscribe. See you next time.